guys welcome to my channel so if you are still finding it difficult to translate your 1688 app i have brought good news for you today so in this video i'm going to be teaching you how to translate your 1688 app easily without stress i'm going to be teaching you two methods one is for you to be chatting um, um sellers on 1688 now fast fast you know with your keyboard you can be chatting them straight up straight 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 in with english and it will be translating to chinese immediately at the same time so watch this video to learn how to translate your 1688 app so let's get started so guys i'll be showing you two methods on how to translate 1688 app the first one is this i dictionary i dictionary app this app helps you to translate a uh, moses edit app immediately as you are using it you can translate it immediately so for you to download the app just go to your um, play store go to your play store like this then search for i dictionary then install this don't install the first one no. install the second one i dictionary so since i already have it installed you just to open it when it shows anything like this you close it then when you open and close it it's something will show on the screen if you look at my screen you see where there's one small white white something and there's arrow there one white circle like that close to the edge of the screen where yeah, my hand is you see that there's arrow there click on it like this yes this is the eye translate so you can have it on your screen like this to translate it now let's go to 1688 let us use it this is the 1688 app click on it so this is the app now let's try the translator so we are clicking on that white arrow on the screen on the left hand side click on it like this that is it the eye translate is is out you can see that eye there so when you move it since we just installed the app it is asking for us to set permission so when it shows you this just set the permission okay then it will take you to where you will do that so we are going to be translating this chinese language right now live so let's click on the i translate so when you click on it it will turn to i like this then you when you click on it it will now be showing this search icon so just place it on the chinese language you want to translate can you see that how long does it take to ship then you can move it to any chinese language on the screen one buyer asked one buyer asked now let's move up let's keep going now let's translate this one can you see that you see the way it translated it christmas word accessories for 2023 christmas word and merry christmas stereoscopic lamps so let's keep translating let's put on this one open and enjoy a 70 you want red envelope a maximum savings of of 20 you want can you see that so anything you want to translate at all on this 1688 app this is your go-to translator i translate this second method is how to chat with seller on this 1688 app you will be typing in english language and it will automatically translate it to chinese language for you so this is the method look at the right hand side you see the three dots on your right hand side the new phones new phones comes with this this um, method already of translating using the keyboard right so if you don't if you don't have it what i'm about to show you now click on this three dot on the right hand side when you click on it like this you see that translates translate click on translate so when you click on translate the next thing is for you to type in english let's say you want to say I want to make inquiry. I want to make inquiry. 
then after you type it like this look below below your right hand side you will see where there is a a click on that a then automatically it has translated it to chinese language and you send it to the seller so the new phones the new android comes with this this feature this feature of to translate while you are typing you can even do it on other on that platform even if it's facebook instagram whatsapp let me show you that it also works on whatsapp so this is whatsapp now i want to chat myself on whatsapp then i want to chat myself in chinese language so click on the same thing just for do the same method click on the three dots then click translate then you know go ahead and type it hello how are you then translate it to chinese and send it you see you can change it to any language of your choice if you want to chat somebody in, in french even in Hausa, just click here when you click on this arrow let me show you again click on this arrow where there is chinese simplified that arrow that is looking downwards click on it once you click on it even if you want to chat someone in Hausa language just look for Hausa. look at Hausa language here then you want to say um how are you how are you in Hausa language can you see that yeah 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 can you see that so that is chinese see so this is how it works so if you don't have this feature on your phone right now maybe when you click on the three dots you don't see it just go to play store let me go to play store and show you so go to your play store like this then download google keyboard google keyboard okay google keyboard mm -hmm. google keyboard translate can you see that so this is the google keyboard translate it is called gboard let me open it gboard that is google board you know when you install this app you can use it to do the translate that you want just install it and you'll be able to do the same thing that i did right now thanks for watching guys i hope this video is helpful and i hope you learned something today please don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more of my videos and click on the like button so that youtube can show it to more people and also share this video and drop comment if you have any question and feel free to join my youtube membership and you have exclusive access to a um, lot of videos you have a um, opportunity to request for videos and i will make the video and upload it to you my members so guys Thanks for watching once again. See you in my next video. Bye-bye.